like this. And of course, we can take a snapshot of each view. For example, the 3D view, we can take a snapshot. Slice view, we can take a snapshot. Section view, we can take a snapshot. I think a snapshot we will cover in the uh, later uh, sessions, but to, to, to do the snapshot here, these buttons here, so you just click on the snapshot. But we have the, before we click on that button, we can configure our snapshot first. Uh, I think I can talk a little bit about the snapshot here. So before we do the snapshot, uh, you can click on this arrow and uh, click preferences. Then here, snapshot will open, preferences will open. And uh, here, important one is this window size. So if you want to uh, change resolution of your snapshot, you can click the fix and enter whatever number you want to use. Otherwise, if you are on the windows, then Imaris will always take snapshot of this window size, this window size, this black, black part. Okay. So here is the preferences. If you want to change to a higher resolution, you can always also change here. So if you want to make it square, I can change. So it will make square like this. Okay. And once you are on the fixed size, you will see this warning here. Because when you are on the fixed size, Imaris will change this window size actually physically here. So sometimes you feel like, oh, why I have so many uh, empty space here? That is maybe because you check this fixed size. So just change back. Okay. So most important is this, this uh, resolution. This is the only uh, settings that will affect your output result, the, the quality of your output result here. Uh, this DPI here actually is just for, for uh, indication of how many DPI you want to uh, print. It's for printers. So how many DPI you want to print these images. If you change these numbers, uh, it doesn't really, it doesn't change the output actually, the output quality. So only thing matters is these uh, two numbers, width and height here. Okay, and you can change the uh, format. And here for the output uh, directly, you can use always the source image directly or always from the users or a spe specific uh, folders for the output images. So always from the users. So here, for example, I want to take a snapshot here. So I just click. So I can save to my desktop like this. What you see is what you get. Or slice view, I can take a snapshot for this, exactly this view. Or the section view, I can take a snapshot of this section view. So whenever you see this uh, snapshot button is clickable, then you can take a snapshot of the display window, okay? Okay, so after you make some changes, uh, display or image properties, you always want to uh, save or save us another, uh, save us another uh, individual changed or processed image files. So these two buttons, quite straightforward. Okay, so today I think uh the topics we are going to cover i think i cover them all and uh, for the more details ones uh, you will be on the later uh, sessions